fire guts a Middletown apartment building, leaving more than a dozen families without a place to live. Christian Hauser shows us what crews had to do to get it under control and get everyone out safely. Fire crews were dispatched just before 11. Michelle Ricardez got a call from her son about the fire. We have two cats and a dog, and I have my daughter-in-law that's pregnant, and I needed to get home and because uh, they was evacuating right now. Ricardez got home as quickly as she could. I found uh, my son and my daughter and uh, everything, so everyone was fine. But I went around the front, and I seen the flames still going high. When we got here, the fire was already in the, in the attic in the above the second floor and it ran that attic pretty quickly. Uh, we were able to cut off the fire at the firewalls inside the building. Assistant Chief Snively says crews initially went inside to battle the fire. Once we realized that it was running that attic space above the firemen that were working inside, uh, we decided it was not it was not safe for them to be in there. So we evacuated everybody out. More than 50 firefighters from 14 different agencies across Butler and Warren counties came to help. About 15 to 20 apartments were damaged. Many of the people were still in their apartments when firefighters got there, so crews had to go knock on doors to get everyone out. I seen the flames and I started talking to some people that had, it was very sad, that had lost everything. Luckily, there are no reports of people hurt inside and no firefighters were hurt either. Everyone is being helped out by the Red Cross. In Middletown, Christian Hauser, Local 12 News. Investigators think they know where the fire started, but they say it is going to be a while before they know exactly what caused it.